Christian with Chris, J uh, Chris Jacobello channel. I just wanted to do a real quick, um, let me see what I want to call it, OOTD, or, yeah, anyway, so it's just going to be really brief, um, today I'm carrying this katana, or whatever, chitin, got this and I've just got this unicorn tag that I've been wanting forever in a year. Um, and then I'm wearing, just got this for Christmas for my sister. And then I'm wearing this necklace. This is from James Avery. And then this is from Louis Vuitton. The cord off the thing. I just thought, what can you do? I have so much of this ribbon. It's unreal. Anyway, it's real leather. Then I'm wearing my James Avery bracelet. I have this one. And then I have... Maybe I, okay, I can't turn it around. And then I'm wearing this, and then I'm wearing a Louis Vuitton Hockenham uh, cuff or bracelet, whatever. And then I have on a Louis Vuitton belt, which you can't see because I'm sitting down. And then I'm wearing my Louis Vuitton Hockenham uh, shoes. I don't know if you can see them. My car's kind of dirty, so kind of my car. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go today to go pick up my watercolor scarf, the white one. Um, and what else? Oh, and I'm gonna go ahead and make reservations for some stuff that for handbags are coming out for my wife. I don't necessarily buy everything that I put on reservation, although, or place into reservation, although some of the essays kind of don't like that. But if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. I'm not gonna spend the money on something that we can't use or she can't use, I can't use, she can't use, or it's just gonna be sitting there. So. I know it kind of bugs them that you do that and they expect for you to buy, but again, I'm not going to buy something that I know that I can't either sell or keep and find use for. Um, so don't be afraid to, don't be afraid to um, ask questions. My hair is kind of funky today, I need to fix that. Anyway, I look at, this is my rule of thumb. Um, it's my money. I'm gonna spend the money, my money, how I want to spend it. So I guess I have a final say. Although sometimes it is a little bit, you feel, I feel kind of not pressure, but obligated to do so. So I have to take a step back sometimes. And my wife, she just doesn't have, she tells me like it is. She's like, look, if you're not gonna use it, if we don't have use for it, or I can't, she can't use it, then what's the point of buying it? So kind of have that mentality now um, before they would place orders for you they wouldn't take reservation now they call it a reservation but before they didn't do that and they didn't take your your credit card information but now they do that so it's important that they I mean it's part of the process and, and they could want to make sure that you are wanting to purchase but again if it comes in and it's not something that you're that you're interested in or you find that it's gonna work for you don't buy it no big deal Keep it moving. Just tell them that it's not what you expected. And and trust me, some of these things in the pictures, they look nice. And when you see them in person, you're like, well, that's not what I thought it had in mind. So, but yeah, I'm on the way to, I'm not on the way. I'm actually on the way to work. I stopped here at Walgreens. I got to buy hairspray to control this mess here because we were out of hairspray. Um, and I'm going to buy some lip balm or chapstick or whatever you call it. Cause it is a cold day here in Houston. It's 52. And then one thing I wanted to share with you all, I saw Lady Gaga yesterday here in Houston. She's really sweet, sweet girl. Uh, excuse me, I'm sorry. Um, let me see what else. I'm still waiting for my Waller Cutter, Waller, excuse me, Watercolor um, Brazo Wallet, which is the, it's from the Chapman Brother Collection, Chapman Brother Collection. Um, I, I tend to talk fast and I think I think my tongue kind of gets caught up I talk really fast and sometimes I have to repeat myself or I find myself stuttering but it's because I'm trying to my brain is thinking faster than when my mouth is wanting to move so anyway my so the there's the Chapman brother collection and there's two two collections there's the ink which is all blue like navy blue and then there's the watercolor which is white with the navy blue so I'm waiting for the watercolor 
bronzer wallet with the white canvas and it has blue monogram and it has a, a yellow giraffe in the front and that's the only reason why I want it because it has yellow in it um, I got the watercolor t-shirt and buying the watercolor scarf or stole today um, I wanted the tags but I don't think that's a go because the global store here in Houston is only receiving one and it, that one sold within seconds um, so yeah I'll just probably just save up for the supreme line that's coming out here in the in the summer like maybe I think August or September um, I want their denim jacket I want that monogram canvas hat I want the keychain if I can get one I don't care for the utility knife one but I care for the other there's another one that I saw that has monogram I also like that monogram with the black stamp on it I think that's I mean super chic I think it's pretty um, trendy and it's masculine and I think it's I think it's different um, I don't care for the red monogram if however if this there's two scarves coming out and if one of them was a thin material like the stoles or like the shawls I would buy that but I think it's gonna be that kind of thick material like wool it doesn't get that cold here in Houston. I mean, it gets cold, but not for you to wear that. I mean, not for me to spend that kind of money and invest it and not go and grab it. Because um, I know if I have it, I won't use it because of the, the material being so thick. Um, what else did I want it from that collection? I would I would like the Brazil wallet, like I said, the monogram Brazil wallet with the black circle. It's like a black hot stamp and it has a huge LV across it. I would like that. Maybe a one camel piece. Maybe. I'm not really sure. And if they have a, a, a Supreme Red Monogram wallet, I'll get something like that. Something small, nothing bright. I mean, nothing too large. I know that the key balls are going for like almost $8,000. And I know the trunks are going for like $58,000 or $48,000, which is ridiculous. Even if I had the money, I wouldn't buy that. Um, let me see what else is there coming out. There's a, there's for you women who are out there, there's a Noe coming out. The new Noe, it's a PM size and it's, monogram and the interior lining comes in three colors it comes in cerise which is or rouge which is red um, it comes in powder pink which is like a rose ballerine pale pink and it comes in nor which is black and then the underlining of the strap monograms on the outside and the underlining is the color that matches the interior so um, if you want more, more information about that you can PM me and I'll send you a picture of that that's coming out next this month later this month um, the Pasha Matisse and Emprunt is coming out in three color, four colors. It's coming out in um, Cerise Rouge, which is red, Noir, which is black. It's coming out in Powder Pink, which is Rose Ballerine, and uh, Marine Rouge, which is the navy blue with the red lining. That's coming out. Some stores in the States have it, um, but it's supposed to release here in, in, our, in Houston. We're supposed to get them sometime in the middle of March. So that's coming out. Um, they've already released the Felici and the Epi, which is in the Rose Ballerine. They're supposed, they're supposed to be releasing one in black, which is Noir. And then also they're going to be releasing an Emprunt Felici, which I thought should be interesting. Um, let me see what else is coming out. And then they have the new uh, Louis Vuitton Azure with the pink flower all over it. If you're interested, that's coming out. I I kind of I ask a lot of questions. I ask my essay a lot of questions. I'm really close to the store manager at Saks, and even though she's not supposed to share a lot of these things with me, but I feel like it brings them more clientele because I give my clients and my friends and my um, my circle or community I kind of give them the heads up so they're kind of aware and it kind of pushes them to want to buy more or want to kind of reserve so if you want to um, want me to connect you to my essay I'll be more than glad to PM you their her information she's super amazing Missy and Dominic and Mike Mike is awesome they all work for the Saks Boutique in the Galleria and if you want to essay at the main global store in the Galleria you can um, look up you can um, look for it. Yvette. Yvette's really sweet. She's really um, she, she's really quick to respond to my text messages. So yeah, I can give you their information. Just PM me or direct message me and I'll send you their information, um, their phone numbers. Um, let me see what else I wanted to share with you all. What is coming out? So I'm really into their clothing line now. Before I was like, I'm not a big, it wasn't a big deal to me for the ready 
ready to wear clothing line but ever since I bought that t-shirt from the Chapman brother collection I'm more wanting I'm really interested in buying more of their clothing if it's something that I would you know want to wear or something that I would want to keep in my collection um, so yeah that's it I, what else I wanted to share with you all I think that's it there's some really nice mustard co yellow colored or yeah mustard color yellow yellow mustard color expert joe's that just came out i want to get those i just have to save a little more for that um and then the super bowls this weekend so we're not planning to leave our side of the side of town our neighborhood or our house for that matter because it's going to be extremely busy but i hear a lot of celebrities are going to be performing on washington which is like the in uh, thing to be where to be at and I was gonna kind of come in, convince my wife for us to go out maybe Friday night tonight Which is Friday or Saturday night. That's if she wants to she's probably gonna say no I don't want to leave Stevie. My son's name Stevie Stevie Kennedy and she doesn't like to leave him um, With my mother or with no one she says that we're gone all week working. So why are we gonna Be gone on the weekend, which is kind of true. But anyway so I think that's it of that's uh, all I had to say about my vlog and my rambling. Um, and then one day, if I can, I'm getting a new camera, a vlogging camera, because I want to kind of vlog when I go visit my essays to, to can kind of get the experience that I have with them and the relationship that I have with them. is I'm pretty comfortable there. I mean, it's like I walked in and it's like my second home. That's how much of an addict I am. Um... Anyway, I think that's it. So, thanks for tuning in. Talk to you later.